A Prayer to Choose Life by Tiffany Tabalt, read by Leah Martin. This day I call the heavens and the earth as witnesses against you, that I have set before you life and death, blessings and curses. Now choose life, so that you and your children may live, and that you may love the Lord your God, listen to his voice, and hold fast to him, for the Lord is your life. Deuteronomy 30, 19 through 20. We have a choice to make every single day, life or death, blessings or curses. We get to choose. Two drastically different options for us to decide what we want for our lives. Of course, no one wants death and curses. We all want to live, to thrive, to be happy. We all want blessings and a fulfilling life. The world is full of blogs and books and podcasts that tell us how to be the best, how to live the best, and how to achieve the best. But this Bible verse tells us something different. Our Bible verse tells us what true living looks like. It's a fulfilled life that doesn't revolve around me. The blessed life doesn't focus on me and my wants and needs, but It does require every single part of me to be able to live that fulfilling life that the Lord is promising. It's a determined heart that makes the decision to choose life and blessings. It's a committed heart that loves the Lord, making Him your God. And it's conditioned ears to hear His voice. And it's strong hands and mind to hold fast to Him. A happy life means making the Lord your life. All of your life, every single part of it. Every thought, every action, every relationship, every habit, every attitude, every decision. Every single part of it needs to reflect the truth that the Lord is your life. This Bible verse offers a promise to us. If we're determined to choose life, to give the Lord every part of our life, then He will not only give us life, but He'll also give our children life. He will bless them because of the choice we make about who is the Lord of our life, me or God. Today, think about your actions, your situations. Who's in charge? Can you turn some of your burdens over to the Lord? Can you trust him a bit more for your concerns? Open the Bible, dig in deep, pray through the verses as you read. He'll meet you there. He will bless you. He will guide you and he will strengthen you. As you continue this daily habit, you'll begin to love him more. You'll begin to hear his voice. Your faith will grow stronger and your life will become happier. You'll begin to see problems solved. You'll see relationships healed. You'll begin to have hope, and you'll become excited about the future that God has for you. So today, choose life by choosing to walk every day with God. Let's pray. Dear Lord, thank you for giving me choice And today, Lord, I choose life. I choose to follow you always. Help me to know you more as I read the Bible. Increase my faith and trust in you in all my hard situations. Help me to hear your voice guiding me and correcting me as I spend time in prayer and in the Bible. Help me to make the right choices when it's so hard to do. Help me to hold fast to you when I'm tired and weak. Today, Lord, I choose life by choosing to make you my life. Amen.